how to add Klarna to Shopify store. Hi guys and welcome back to another video here on this channel, WebWiz. So in this video, I will be showing you how you can add Klarna to your Shopify store. Stay tuned as we proceed to this tutorial. So let's get started. So the first thing you have to do is you have to create your account over here for your business. If you're not a shopper but you're trying to integrate Klarna for your business, you have to come to this link and then you have to click on this sign up and then after that, then adding all your details in the Klarna. Simply click on allow and create button account. So once you click on this create account button, it will ask for the further details and it will take you to the Klarna merchant portal. Basically, it's the homepage and then you have to go to this integration guides. Keep in mind that you have to log in your store as an admin. Only the owner is able to integrate the Klarna payment getaway. So the first thing that you have to do is that once you click on this integration guide, just wait, let me go back to explain it. So from here, it will ask you to connect your Shopify store. Simply click on this continue button and then it will say that press the button to open your Shopify admin. You will be asked to install Klarna apps if it's not already installed in your store. But if the Klarna app is already installed, click on the Your Manage button from the Klarna payment method to save the app's required access token in our system. So after that, simply click on this Install Klarna Shopify application. So it will ask me for my account information and just fill in the information needed. So it has been added and the Klarna payment method in my Shopify payment section. So you can see that the Klarna payment provider has been added over here. So now after installing the app, I have to generate the API credentials, download them safely, and then click the continue integration button below. So we have to click on the generate and connect credentials button. So these are the Klarna API username and Klarna API password. You can download it according to your Shopify store and then you have to click on this continue integration and after it will say that your Klarna and Shopify accounts has been successfully verified. So just one more step to activate Klarna payment method in your store's checkout. If you have payment not activated payment methods, once you're done, click on the next button. So once you have clicked on it, it will take me to the Shopify payment section. Okay, here I see the Klarna payment method is activated on my Shopify store. So the next step we have to do is to install this app. Let me take you to the app section. You have to add this app Klarna on site messaging. It is used to show the messages on your product page, on card page, or on checkout. So let me click on this app. After opening this app, it will say errors have occurred mid not found for the domain. So please ensure that you have completed this installation guide. We have already completed it, so we have to configure it manually. So you have to click on this button, configure mid manually. So once you click on it, you have to enter the API merchant ID that you have downloaded while creating or connecting your Klarna merchant account with Shopify. So as you can see that I have already downloaded it. So let me see it that I have added on my Klarna API merchant ID are using it after adding it and you have to click on this connect account button. So once clicked on it, it will successfully generate the message that Klarna account is linked 
and you're now able to disconnect your account. But now our Klarna method payment getaway is already integrated. So after doing all the settings, connecting your Klarna account with Shopify, that you have to do is click on this dashboard. After that, it will ask about a blog instructions. So you can click on it and follow all these instructions to add it on the product page similar to this one. So it says that you have to customize your theme and then if you want to add it to the product page, collection page, or the static page or home. So let me go back and give you an overview of what it says that though I have opened a product template, what I have to do is click on the add block button. After that, it will as well for Klarna placement. So simply click it and drag it at the top. After that, click the save button. So let me go back and check what it says. Select Klarna on site messaging and the next step is already done. So if you want to show it a simple text similar to this one, just copy and then go back over here and paste it. Right now it's not showing. So I will show you how this will start getting showing. Okay, so you can also add it over here. Simply copy and paste it within this section placement type. And for all other pages like about on simple static pages, you can simply copy it and paste it. So we have completed all the steps and the once completed all those steps, you have to click on this button to verify and continue. So now it's verified successfully and it will credit promotion badge product page. Until start on the product page, you have to click on this refresh button. And now let's get back to our product page. This is the product page and it starts showing over here. And the one last thing that I forgot to add is it is, is local. So you have to add an N dash US, then it will start getting shown. So this is the end of this tutorial. I hope that this video helped you learn more about how to add Kalarna to Shopify store. Again, this is WebWiz and we will see you on the next video. Bye!